Sawadika. So today we are on day two of our New Hampshire trip. And actually right now it is only seven in the morning. And the family is already up. <laughs> Everyone's been up for a while already. I don't think anyone really had a proper night's sleep last night since it was still a new place so you don't really quite get used to sleeping outside of your own bed. Today we have a lot of uh, itinerary on the list. Uh, I am planning to take them out to a few hikes and trails around this area as well as um, checking out some of the attractions um, that is quite popular out here. So. I'm not going to uh, reveal yet where we'll be going. You guys have to come with us and uh, yeah, just enjoy the day with us. Anyway, Amala and Anila has been cooking since 5.30 in the morning because we are planning to go for a picnic as well at some point uh, for lunch. And then Ashangla is just doing his morning yoga, it looks like. <laughs> yep doing his morning yoga and enjoying the, the view of the upcoming sunrise which should happen very soon so it's a good start to our second day we're gonna have our breakfast Shugala is going to be cooking he wants to uh, show off his uh, cooking skills <laughs> so after that we will take you guys out for the day and hope you guys enjoy So today, Mr. Shugella is going to cook us all breakfast. What are you making again, Shugella? A sausage mix with tomato, mm -hmm. onions, and um, a little bit of soy sauce. Nice. So on the first uh, morning that he reached here, he actually made this for us. And it tasted really good, so... Uh, we decided that it would be a good idea for him to make it for the whole family. Right, Shagel? Mm -hmm. The automatic. Automatic, mm -hmm. uh -huh. Help her. <laughs> he didn't want to do this bit because the oil was spitting too much. some fruits here, some boiled eggs, bacon, Shogella's um, sausages that he made for us especially, toast, avocado, bananas, and Amala and Anila's pale. So yeah, let's eat. Save your sausages, it's gonna be a hit, huh? Mm -hmm. head out for the day unfortunately the weather is a little bit gloomy but definitely it's not going to deter us from going out and enjoying ourselves 
So yeah, let's get going. The first place we're heading off to is the Basin's okay, uh, yeah. Trail. <laughs> 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 Anila, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> it's like, where's that voice coming from? And here's the picnic stuff for today. So we have chai and we have Amala and Anila's dal and um, Shapta, I think, is in here. Shigella, ready? Let's go. Amala, ready? Let's go. Let's go. Hey guys, we just reached the Basin Cascade Trailhead and unfortunately the weather has gotten a little worse since we uh, drove further up the mountain so that's why it's raining a little bit more now. It's a little wet and foggy but uh, we're still gonna try and walk towards the basin anyhow. Ah, such a bad weather. <laughs> Oh. That's it started when we came. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so wet. <laughs> Shigella didn't have his raincoat so I gave him mine. Now it looks like a a, a crop top. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Too bad after you get going for a while. There's actually quite a lot of people walking despite the rain, so we shouldn't let it stop uh, us having fun today. Ah, there's a trail here. Wow, look at this. I think we've reached the basin, everyone. This is it. Oh, that's really beautiful. We're finally here at the basin and it looks like that this is actually naturally made from over 25,000 years ago. Wow. That's really, really interesting. Since the ice age, the water eroded the solid granite bedrock, which creates this basin looking uh, waterfall right here. Okay guys, so we're at the next destination <laughs> of our itinerary. The Lonesome Lake Trail is off that way. It should, this path should lead us to the lake itself and there should be a loop around the lake. So it could possibly take like an hour or so. So yeah, let's go.
Okay, quick update. <laughs> so, it's been maybe an hour and a half, almost two now of us just hiking and coming up this brutal mountain. And it doesn't seem like we're reaching it anytime soon, the destination. So, we may actually have to retreat back down to the base of the mountain and plus the conditions the weather conditions as you can see is really foggy and slippery so it's probably best if um, we start heading back down again because it will take us another hour or so just to trek down the mountain plus also worried about Amala Anila and Ashangla as well going uphill like this is pretty brutal uh, but it's still really beautiful though very very worth coming up um, as much as we did lunch now um, I think after this we are going to head over to Kankamangas Highway just uh, just to drive through the scenic route and of course uh, now that the weather's cleared up a bit we can really enjoy and appreciate the foliage a little bit more and if it doesn't get too late we might stop by at some of the scenic points and the attractions along the route so yeah that is where we're heading now have to be quick about it though because it's um it's already almost four o'clock so we don't want it to get too dark <laughs> stop of today this is Rocky Gorge we decided to pay this one a visit because uh, I saw a bunch of really great reviews uh, for this particular attraction so hopefully it will be nice but already I'm seeing a lot of people enjoying it uh, so pretty it's like around five or six, well, five, almost six. 